Here's Kevin Zach, and now denying what the King James Bible actually says. And now he's going to say, forgotten way means unique. Uh, because, uh, you know, the issue is that Jesus Christ was the unique person in the universe. But that's not dealing with, dealing with his beginning. The beginning has to deal with him being born. So Kevin Zach has to get rid of that. And watch him be a little. And throw about secret knowledge and stuff. You get this. This is the same guy who tried to sneak in a, a footnote in the uh, book and from Genesis the uh, from the uh, translators and, and put try to make that part inspired scripture this guy's not a King James Bible believer as he hath by inheritance obtained a more excellent name than they for unto which of the angels said he at any time thou art my son this day have I begotten thee and again I will be to him a father and he shall be to me a son now I want to talk a little bit about the word begotten oh, and Begotten here for Jesus Christ does not mean just to be born into the world. No, it doesn't, huh? It's exactly what it means. So now we're getting a private interpretation from Kevin Zacker. He is the only begotten Son of God. Yeah, because he's the only Son that the Father directly conceived. That's what it means only begotten. It doesn't mean unique. Means the only one the father directly was involved in the conception of. He is unique. There is no one else. If you should search. See, now he's raising his voice like that changes something. Begotten doesn't mean unique. He's only begotten of the father, which means he is directly related to the father from that beginning. That's what it means. The universe. Uh, from one part all the way to the other, the whole Milky Way galaxy, the Andromeda galaxy, all these different places, and search the high and low, far and wide, you will not find another Jesus Christ. It has to do with the beginning. So this is how Kevin has to operate. Kevin is his own little world. He makes stuff up as he goes along. And then he talks about Gnostics having secret knowledge. You can't change the word beginning to mean what you want to make it mean. Because you want to make Jesus Christ unique. He is the unique person in the universe. But that has to do with, deal with the beginning. He's the only begotten son of God. And that happened in time. And that shows a direct relationship to the father. But that issue doesn't change the word beginning to unique. He is unique. No one else is fully God and fully man. Um, he yeah. The two persons, the two natures come to one person. But that beginning occurred in time. Not eternity. And begetting means being born. In order for him to be unique, he had to have human nature come on there. That's what made him unique. God and man coming together. So the begetting was necessary for him to become unique. Kevin has a hard time with this uh, thinking. Did what he did to save mankind. See, beginning is not unique. Beginning is what made him unique. Let me stop right here. I'm going to put this up. This is just unbelievable. And again, Kevin Zacker just denies the King James Bible, puts in what he wants to put in. Uh, I'm going to deal with the rest of the videos. I got uploading some up, but this is just shows you. These guys know what he's talking about. And uh, you have to just write him off. Write him off. You know, he's just going to go in any direction he wants when he sees it. See, it, it doesn't fit what he wants it to fit, he'll make it fit. Try. Amen. Thank you.